Hello, hello, and welcome to Movie Pillow Fights. I am Brienne, also known as Miss Movies. And I'm Stacey Howard. And each week, Stacey and I take one question from Twitter or yeah. somewhere else about movies, and we discuss it. Talk and about it. And sometimes throw pillows. Fine about That's it. That's about it. Just a little right? bit. Yeah, just a little violence in our lives. We do a show called Six Degrees of Feature Film, which you can find mm -hmm. here on iTunes, SoundCloud, and Stitcher. And this week we have John Stephen Roca with us <gasps> to talk I about him. Himself. The outlaw, yeah. as they call him. Mm -hmm. He's back. He's been on our show before. Mm -hmm. And we're talking Hell or High Water. So that's our feature film. Yes. There it is. So our question from Twitter this week was from Benjamin McElroy. Hey. He wants to know if we had a director who could direct our biopic. Who would mm -hmm. we choose? Okay. Um, this one's tough. There's so many good ones out there. There are so many good ones out there. Yes. And I'm going to go with one of my favorites. Um, although I haven't seen Robin Hood from 2010. Uh, but I love you, Ridley Scott. Like, you yeah. are one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. And um, I don't know your life story. I don't know everything about you. So I'm sure if Ridley Scott comes up on any sort of trivia, I might not know the answer to it. Yes. But I love you. I love Alien. Mm -hmm. uh, it's you my do. favorite film. Uh, I did like Prometheus, even though I like plenty Prometheus of people did a lot. not. A lot of controversy. <laughs> so, you know. Very dividing I, movie. I would love it if mm -hmm. you would do that. That'd be cool. That'd if be I could be there checking it out. It I mean, be, it, so, it would be a boring story. It would be so But boring. it would be made epic by his filmmaking. Everything he does in the, is on such a grand scale, I mm -hmm. feel like. So it, it would make everything just amplified. It would. All the happenings of your life. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All the <laughs> play you? dates with your kids. Everything would oh, just be, be an, an be adventure. Great. For me, um, one of my favorite filmmakers has made incredible thrillers, uh, mysteries, almost horror-like films, David Fincher. Oh, yes. Of Love course. It. Of course. I mean... You know, with more commercial things like Gone Girl and The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, and then some of his earlier films like with uh, um, Seven and uh, with Fight Club and everything, his stories are so unique and so powerful and so just strange and really just give you that what I love when I watch movies that uncomfortable feeling where I feel like I'm watching mm -hmm. something I shouldn't watch or see something I shouldn't see. Uh, if I were to want someone to direct a biopic and about my life, which is also very boring, and make it interesting, he would be the one to do it because he's a genius and he's so much into detail mm -hmm. that it would just be incredible. Like you look at something like, um, you know, Zodiac. I mean, the the detail and the information in that film could be really boring. It's all just yes. paperwork and police work, but he makes it fascinating. So I want I, that director. I just hope he has a Starbucks cup in every single scene. Yep. That's what I want to see. Thank yep. you, Fight Club. Mm -hmm. There you go. So I love it. Yeah. Ridley Scott, David Fincher, yeah. what about you? What yeah, director would you uh, choose to direct the biopic of your life? Who knows? I'm interested to see this. Okay, guys. Thanks Tell for watching. Us. Yeah, let's Or talk. we're coming for you. Yeah. We're coming for yeah. each other first. Oh, you really hit my face. This. Sorry. Okay, though. It's okay. Sorry. I'm going to hit your knee. Thanks, friend. <laughs> All right. yeah. Bye, guys. All right. Bye. 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 Bye.